May. So we have all the veggies, all that planted, gardens ready to go. And now let's bring some beauty into the yard. And we bring in Mark Toms from Good Earl May Stores. Good to see you. Good to see okay, you. Okay, so this weekend's pro project is bringing in some plants that attract the butterflies, the bees, things like that. Bees, yep. important to have around. Um, so important to have some plants that they like. Yep. So you have a few suggestions yeah. for us. So last year we had great success with this. And, and we did this with folks last year and people just love to get out in the yard with the kids and the family and just create a nice little butterfly garden for the kids to watch butterflies and mm -hmm. and we do need to start doing things for the bees too so we don't lose them and help the environment a little bit with that we've got some bee shelters at the mm -hmm. stores that are popular with the folks to help attract the bees so that if with no bees our plants aren't going to pollinate and so well forth, exactly right? so yes let's attract our bees and in the same time let's uh, help the butterflies and the, and the hummingbirds <laughs> as well it's fun to watch hummingbirds oh yeah no so doubt about it there's a lot of plants and we can walk through a few and so forth but if you um a lot of folks just they've got some big areas in the yard or some open space in yeah. the backyard that they want to attract butterflies and so forth we've got a nice couple nice seed mixtures for your pollinators and your butterflies and your hummingbirds so just sprinkle this around and it go will out grow there making scratch the soil okay. up real nice sow your seeds keep it damp just like yeah. in everything else and see what comes up and see what come up and yeah and create yeah. yourself a little butterfly garden if not and you want to do a raised bed we've talked about this before there's mm -hmm. all kinds of plants right down here in front is your your, your butterfly bush, and, and those will produce nice big blossoms that the butterflies really, really love, all different colors and all that. Does that need to be in sun? Yep, most of the plants for your butterfly garden, Our give them sun, as much sun as spot. you can give them, all right? Okay. And if we just kind of want to lay some things out, salvia here, another great plant to attract your, your butterflies. Mm -hmm. This, Mandevilla, if you it's like beautiful. Watch, yep, if you like watching the hummingbirds, they like that cone shape, whether it's red or pink, to attract your mm -hmm. hummingbirds. Um, cat mint, a great plant. To okay. attract your butterflies and bees. Does that attract your or cat mint, cat not mint. cat nip? No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Cone flowers attract your bees and your butterflies yeah, I, as well. Yeah, those are common around and here. And you know what? There's even some herbs that like to attract the butterflies. Spearmint will do that as well for you. you can plant, put that in your garden. Okay. Um, this is Eclipsia. This is the butterfly perennial, all right? And a lot oh, of folks, okay. it comes in yellow and orange puts off really beautiful blossoms. So does that come back every year? This is very good. This yeah. is a perennial that comes back every year for you. That really will attract your monarchs to watch and so oh, forth. Okay. okay. Hollyhocks is another one. They get real nice and tall. Put them in the back of your garden. But you can just create a nice colorful look to attract mm -hmm. your bees and your yeah, butterflies. Yeah, I love this. This is beautiful. A couple things to keep insects away. Yeah. Mosquitoes. Huh? What do you got for yeah, us? Yeah, so it will get that time, right? Yeah. Citronella plant. Um, mm. Nice to put in your planters or just even plant around your patio. Yeah. Smell that lemony and so forth. Yeah, it that smells will, good. Yeah, that'll keep your, that'll your keep mosquitoes, mosquitoes away. away. Well, as long as in, uh, lemongrass, okay. and that works as a nice... So maybe if you have a patio, you could like line your patio Line your with patio it. and plant that all around to keep the mosquitoes away. Sit and enjoy the butterflies. Oh yeah, I love it. Okay. And those won't repel the butterflies, no, they won't. will they? No. Okay. So you'll Just be fine. the mosquitoes. Keep your mosquitoes away. Okay, good. Well, great for the suggestions. If you have any questions about what you saw here, of course, you can reach out to Mark or any of the Earl May stores. They can help you out. And uh, looks like I have a lot of planning to do this weekend. Thanks, have Mark. Fun. Have a great day. We'll be back just after this. This segment sponsored by Earl May.